Okay, I have to cut out a spot for a sink in this countertop. So I'm gonna use a track with a special stopper, the new TS60, and two clamps. First, we'll line up the track on the line, then throw our clamps on. Then we can put the saw on, and this line right here at the back will mark the back side of where the blade will cut into the plunge cut. So I can line that up with the back of where I want the cut to be, and then I can come slide this thing on the back. And it will slide right in this back slot here, and then it fits just over the back side of the saw and I can tighten it down. And then when I go to plunge my saw down, this holds the back of the saw from kicking up, preventing kickback. And then I can go along making my cut and I can either watch the blade or this front line right here, which also shows the front side of my blade, making sure I don't cut past my cut line.